Widowhood is a dot in the journey of a woman, but not the bastard. Widows should devise means to move forward with the tide and become better persons. This is the takeaway from a program organized for the widows in Lagos State. The program was aimed at addressing the challenges uh, that widows in Nigeria are currently facing and how to put an end to it. According to the organizer, the death of a spouse is not the end of the world. Widows must raise up and continue with their lives. A lot of widows think that after the death of their spouse, it's the end of the world. But, you know, this program is to help improve their mindset, help them to reintegrate it into the society, navigate their pain, and, you know, find better opportunities, you know, so that they can soar, they can thrive, and they can, you know, bring value to the society. There are several factors that you can consider in overcoming widowhood. The first one is prayer. You cannot under, undermine the power of, you know, spiritual intelligence and you need a lot of skill, a lot of resources to get there and you have to um, invest in the work of your hand. What do you do? What do you have? The government can improve the life of widows by enforcing you know, the law against harmful widowhood practices. Some of the interventions recommended are prayers, personal development, mentoring, and associating with those who can make them better persons. With some widows present as the event spoke on the challenges. It was also suggested that the government's intervention was needed especially in removing the discriminatory cultural practices and stigmatization. Financial and emotional support were also recommended as other means of helping widows to get over the loss of their spouses and be reintegrated into the society. These people are first human beings before what has happened to them. So I would say that orientation in some kind of way, creating awareness about the struggles of being a widow, the journey of widowhood to the non-widowed community. Apart from providing resources and platforms for widows to either get some empowerment, the non-widowed community would need to be thought a little bit more on how to take care of us, how to support us in their immediate environment. I think widows are human beings that need a lot of support. And we need to begin to review how the, the perception of our culture when it comes to widowhood and begin to you know, make the adjustments. You know, government needs to make, make certain adjustments to ensure that both at the you know, state, local government, community level, widows are supported, widows are encouraged, and they don't, we don't make widowhood look like the end of the road for women because it's still possible to be a widow and still be able to live life you know, at your best version despite what has happened to you. My advice to widows is do not wallow in self-pity, do not try to bring yourself down or think that this is the end of the world or think that you cannot achieve more simply because of the position you are in or challenges has put you into. I think this is actually a very period that you have to like move forward and then try to be the best version for yourself and for your kids.